What you doing, good girl? What you doing, Beretta? She's down to feed my babies. She's down to feed my babies, Daddy. Well, hey, everybody. I'm here with Beretta and her newborn pups. Uh, as you can see, doing really good. Uh, this is going to be our newborn video. And uh, really excited to share this with you. She didn't have as many as we were hoping for, but the most important thing is that they're they're here and they're they're very healthy pups. Um, she's got seven total, and we have uh, five girls and two boys. Of course, I've begun discussing with some of you uh, with options there, uh, but for the most part, everyone's going to be able to get a pup here or uh, move to one of the other lists we got coming up here soon with uh, Chloe and Ava. But uh, this is Beretta right here, and uh, she's doing really good. She gave birth on Tuesday, and uh, I'm going to begin touching base with everyone now uh, periodically over the next every 10 to 14 days with a new video update, and then, of course, information that I'm going to uh, relay to you uh, in attachments and other emails along the way. So uh, it's officially kicked off, and uh, we're ready to go. Um, some of the things that you will begin to receive from me at least this first week is going to be the puppy pointer sheet. And that's going to help you kind of just get ready and get prepared uh, for your pup's arrival in the coming weeks ahead. <clears throat> of course, you guys are going to have questions along the way. Feel free to ask them anytime. But uh, I'm going to try to explain a few things that you can expect over the course uh, of the development of the weeks ahead um, here as far as the pups go and things are received from us. Um, <clears throat> for example, the next update we will do when the pup's eyes open and they begin to crawl walk around. And that's usually right around two and a half, three weeks of age. Uh, where we kind of just start going into that what we call the discovery mode and uh, it's a really exciting video because the pups will be identified with different color collars for the first time what you hiding for huh what you hiding from that camera you see the girl you see the girl and uh, what we'll do is uh, we'll mark all the pups with a different color collar and then you'll be able to tell who's who uh, throughout the rest of the development as they grow and develop um, and then um, in that video will normally incorporate a couple different things uh, like the puppy mush video and you get to see them walking and playing and interacting for the first time and uh, doing all those things together. After that we'll do uh, our very first playtime interactive video right around uh, four and a half, five weeks of age and um, of course it being spring we're going to be able to do a lot of that stuff outside which I'm really excited about. And then we'll do a final round of video, the fourth video set, uh, which is when we'll distinguish the pups, the color, the size, the personality types. And we'll interact usually over a two or three day period with different video sets and loop them together so you get a really good true look at all the pups. And of course that will be, that will be filmed some inside, some outside, and then playing and interacting uh, together uh, with, uh, of course, with Mama Beretta and then all the other dogs as well. Um, every time we do an update, of course, I'm going to send you send you stuff um, that's going to prepare you also. Uh, but uh, I try to do that so that really at the end you're very well prepared in advance, and it's all about you and the puppy and the puppy joining joining your family, and you're ready and prepared and all that. So, um, but I try not to bombard you or any, or with it like all of it at once, either at the beginning or the end. So I'll spread spread that stuff out. Uh, for example, towards the very uh, last week. We'll have the medical info sheet and you'll be able to just click print that and bring that with you to your vet to document all the medical history and stuff. Uh, we'll also have like an information sheet we'll send out about four to five weeks and that'll kind of just cover little things like directions, uh, payment, uh, AKC papers, um, the, the microchip, all those things like that. So uh, we, will, we will discuss that in, in time being but uh, for now it's just uh, get excited, uh, mark your calendars, I'll have all that information in your email. Uh, and uh, the pups are here and they're healthy and they're doing really good and Brett is doing really really good taking care of her babies I'm really excited about this litter uh, you can you can tell just looking at the litter and taking after Jericho's genetics which is a really good thing you can see a good healthy dark rust coat throughout this whole litter every pup uh, is going to have that real true nice dark rust uh, color tone uh, and uh, Beretta is more of a golden rust, so you get a lot more gold tone from her, but Jericho is a darker golden rust, and uh, that's a dominant trait, and you're seeing that across the board in this whole litter, so good, healthy, dark rust coats uh, in this litter. I'm going to hold up a few uh, so you can see them, and then uh, I'm going to come in with the camera here at the end uh, on a close-up just to kind of let you see them nursing and everything. She's a good girl. She's a good mama. That's a good girl.
still got your tongue sticking out. I'm going to give him back. I'm going to give him back. That's one of the boys here. I'm gonna give him back, Brad. You silly girl. You silly. Get this one. She said, I want my babies. She said, I want my babies, Daddy. Let's get this big old guy. I got a big old girl. She's a chubby thing. Alright, Sandy. Let's get you situated. See you again. See you again. Good gay or she could go for it. She said, I'm feeding my babies. She said, I'm feeding my babies. Good mama, she's a good girl, Brianna. <laughs>